Hello, hello, my dear friends. Welcome back. I think by now you all know there are times that I like to be a petty Betty, just like Harry and Meghan's degenerate fan base, the Sussex Squids. I enjoy giving them a taste of their own medicine and getting them all worked up. And since they have been bringing up the whole where is Kate nonsense again in a lame attempt to get the heat off of the fact the dim-witted prince and his copper-digging charlatan wife were associating with fraudsters and criminals in Nigeria, I think it is fair game to ask the simple question of where are the phantom hostage unknown most likely feral children named Archie and Lilibet, or as I like to call them, Archificial and Invisibet. Where are these two children who are fraudulently listed within the line of succession? Why is nobody asking where these children are when Archificial hasn't been seen in the public ever? No neighbors have ever seen them, no friends, no family besides Cell Block 6 Doria and the ever greasy looking chubby Marcus Anderson. I refuse to believe a doll that was presented to the world as a newborn was a real baby because it wasn't. Who and where is Invisibet? If the Sussex squad want to obsess over Catherine who announced her medical diagnosis when she didn't have to, when they should be asking the real question of where are the Sussex children? Right before the faux Nigerian tour all about Megan, a California-based balloon company shared a custom-made colorful arrangement that was seemingly made for Archificial's fifth birthday. Ventura County Balloons had uploaded the photo to their Instagram story showing off the balloon sculpture with Archificial's name. The business also included a caption which said, Balloon bouquets all day, every day. DM to book and surprise loved ones. I should mention the owner of the business took the photo herself in her own driveway. And this business deal is supposed to be proof to us, the public, that Archificial had a fifth birthday. This single photo is supposed to be proof that Archificial had friends over and they played a game of tag. All I can say is that I hope Megan saves some money for these children she has no problems using for a paycheck. The same children that nobody has ever seen out with Harry and Meghan. You know, like a normal family. And yet the public is supposed to just accept these two phantom children as Prince Archie of Sussex and Princess Lilibet of Sussex, who are sixth and seventh in line to the throne. Two phantom children who are never seen with their parents, which I find totally strange. And even worse, when you see video of Harry and Meghan interacting with children around their own alleged children's age, they are very awkward. They behave more like the drunk aunt and uncle who have no children. It's very strange. And since these two phantom children are within the line of succession, one needs to keep bringing up the question, where are the Sussex children? Since the Sussex squad want to obsess and harass a woman who is dealing with a serious medical issue, let me be a thorn in the butts of Harry and Meghan and continue on asking for answers to what everyone deserves to know. Where are the Sussex children? Where is Archificial and why didn't he get a party? Where are his friends? Why are Harry and Meghan such horrible people? Why are there two ghosts listed as sixth and seventh place in the British line of succession? I told you guys I was gonna be petty in this video. <laughs> I should probably end it here before it gets too messy. On that note, my friends, what the heck do you think is going on concerning the invisible children and why didn't an Archificial get a party? Let me know in the comments below and I will see you in the next one. Stay gorgeous, lovelies. Bye.